What's up, YouTube? It's Mark from Next Level Tech and Android TV. Tips. <laughs> and I just keep dropping content. So hopefully, you guys are enjoying the content that I'm dropping. Uh, make sure you join the Telegram group. We're well over 2,000 members uh, doing some giveaways of all the Brid vouchers in the Telegram group, as well as hidden as Easter eggs in some of the videos. So I hope somebody caught the last video. Uh, it was hidden in there. You never know where the next giveaway is going to be. As well as right now, uh, NordVPN, link in the description below, has a uh, buy two year, get four months for free deal going on right now. Uh, 75 or 70 percent off, something like that. Check out the link in the description below. Uh, that's the VPN that I use. I will be making a video on it, uh, showing off some of the features in it as well. But that's going to be coming possibly in the next week. Uh, so a comment in one of my recent videos was I'm having issues with MX player. Um, there's no sound. So video files that you're streaming can come in all different kinds of formats and uh, it needs codecs or different kind of codecs to play them, right? I always say if you're having issues, make sure that your hardware decoder is on. Um, and then also you can try using different players, but there's a lot of people that really like using MX player and they only want to use MX player. I've said it in the past, I personally use VLC. That's just a personal preference. But if you're having issues with one player, you can switch to another. I'm just going to go over some really quick things with MX player if you're having an issue to see if it might fix it for you. Some of the versions available to download with MX player come with built in codecs and some don't. So the solutions I'm going to show you here might work or might not work depending on the version that you have downloaded. OK, this is not going to be a long video at all. So right now, top right of MX player, you're going to see the three dots or you can hit the menu button on your Fire Stick remote and then you're going to go down to settings. And then from here, a cool little tip uh, since we're going down the list is you can click on player, you can click on style and then the progress bar, you can actually change it to flat so that you can see how much of the uh, stream that you've buffered so far. Uh, it just gives you an idea of how smooth the playback is going to be. It's really cool. And then you hit OK. Then you would go back and you're going to go down to decoder and you're going to want to make sure that these top two are checked off. And in most cases, in most MX players, they're not checked off. So you want to make sure that you check off your hardware decoder local and your hardware decoder network. Make sure those are both checked off. Uh, all these other ones are going to be checked off. Now, these ones don't really matter. I wouldn't really mess with these. Um, and then the only other thing here is when you go to your audio, some people like to turn on the volume boost uh, just because some of the streams, they can have low volume might be beneficial for you guys. Again, if you're having issues with a player, it doesn't matter what player it is. Take a look at the settings. If you can turn on things like your hardware decoders, turn them on. It's going to help you. Again, if uh, if you still can't fix it, try another player. If you like MX, try VLC. If you like VLC and you're having issues, try MX player. There's other players out there like uh, like uh, EUMC. Uh, there's a bunch of other players out there. So just try them all out and see which ones work best for you. Like I said, guys, this is going to be a really, really quick video. I hope that helped you guys that were having issues uh, playing certain video formats. And I also wanted to mention really quickly, if you are using a Debrid service, you're getting access to a lot more codecs when you're or, or files that require these codecs, right? So all of a sudden you're getting really good quality stuff, but you're not getting audio or you're not getting video. You need to get a better player, right? And make sure that your hardware decoders are on. So if you're using a Debrid service to get those high quality files, that's when you're going to want to try out things like MX player, VLC, UMC, whatever you use but the built-in players are not going to be good for those so you want to get an external player again guys this has been mark from next level tech and i hope that i see you guys in the telegram group because we are growing fast there's so much good information in there and i will see you guys on the next one peace hey everybody uh just before we get going i wanted to say a huge thank you much love and appreciation to everyone who supports what i do over here on next level tech make sure you hit that like and that subscribe button and share these videos with a family member and friend